hello friends welcome to this channel today we are going to see how to set up the mosquito mqtt broker on window based pc and how to use it so let's get started so search mosquito mqtt broker in the google search window click here on the download then this web page will be open go through the information given on this web page you can see here the setup files for different OS, the set of files for Windows, Mac, Linux, Debian, Raspberry Pi and Ubuntu. These are available over here. You can select the set of file as per your OS. I'm going to download this set of file for Windows. Click here on this link. The file is getting downloaded. Copy this file in the appropriate folder. You can run this setup by clicking on this application file. Click here on the next. Install this as service. Click here on the next. Select the destination folder. I am selecting this folder for my PC. And click here on install. So Mosquito setup has been successfully installed. So click here on the finish. You can see in this Mosquito broker folder all the files related to Mosquito MQTT brokers are copied or stored. You can run the Mosquito broker from here itself by clicking over here on this application file called Mosquito. This is the Mosquito configuration file where you can set the configuration for your Mosquito bro broker. Many options are available over here. You can uncomment the statements and set the configuration over here. This is the readme file. Go through the information given in this file. This is the application mosquito underscore pub. We will be using it to publish the message to the broker or the subscriber. And this application mosquito underscore sub is used to subscribe to the topic or the to the broker. Now let us run the mosquito broker on this PC. For that purpose, you need to go to the command prompt. In the command prompt, just go to the folder where mosquito broker files are copied and just type this command mosquito dash v. Dash v is going to show us the activities happening on this broker terminal. So press enter over here. Now you can see broker is running and the port use is 1883 now we are going to test this broker for that purpose we are going to publish some message using the publish command this is the command for publishing the message this is the application mosquito underscore pub which is used for publishing the command dash s is used to indicate the broker address that is local host over here we can type 127.0.0.1 over here also dash t specified the topic for us the topic is topic slash pub dash m just is used to specify the message we are going to publish this message that is message from p1 dash r is used for setting the retain flag so here the written flag will be one dash i is used for specifying the client name and dash d is used for debugging purpose with this we can know what are the activities happening on this mosquito publish terminal press enter here you can see client has sent the connect command then it has in turn received the connect acknowledge from the broker and it has published the message to the broker and client has issued the disconnect command same thing you can see here in the broker terminal this is the new connection request on this port 183 new client has got connected and then as broker has received connection request it is sending the connection acknowledge to the client broker is saying that it has received publish message from the published client 
here the broker has received the publish message from the client broker has received the disconnect command from the client and the connection is disconnected so now we are going to see how to receive this publish message from the client in the third command prompt we are going to set the subscriber mqtt client so this is the command mosquito underscore sub in this command dash h indicates the local host that is the broker address dash t indicates the topic this is the wildcard topic and here dash capital C it is for the disconnection and dash D is for a debugging purpose we are going to remove this dash capital C we want to run this client continuously press enter over here so as we have said the return flag is equal to 1 we have received this message from this MQTT publish client that message is message from P1 here you can see in the broker terminal the communication of the subscriber client with the broker so these are the activities happened rela in relation to the subscriber client now we are going to publish the message over the IP address so let us check the IP address for this network just type the command ipconfig over here this is the network IP address and this is the IP address of the broker as well so now we are going to publish our command using this IP address so instead of localhost we are going to write the IP address for this network that is 192.168.1 100 now we will try to send the message over this IP address press enter now you can see error message has been popped that is no connection could be made because target machine actively refused it so broker is not allowing the remote connections in order to solve this we are going to create one configuration file so open the notepad and copy these statements over here so here listener is listening on the 183 port and this setting allow anonymous is true so that there will be no need of any username and password from the publisher client for establishing the connection with the broker so now save this file in the same folder where the mosquito mqtt broker files are stored save this file as test.config file now we will stop the broker by pressing ctrl c now we are going to run the command mosquito dash v dash c and specify the name of the configuration file that is test.conf and press enter now again broker has started running and it is listening on port 1883 now you can see the pop-up it is the pop-up from the firewall of the windows so as we have made the request for opening the ports for the remote connections in order to grant the permission just click here on allow access now we will issue the publish command again using the IP address 192.168.1.100 just press enter over here and now you can see the message has been published to the broker now we are going to do the same thing with the subscriber we are going to write over here the IP address for the broker let us see whether we get the message 
from the broker press enter and now you can see we have received this message from the publisher this is p1 so now in this video we have seen how to set up the mosquito mqtt broker on the window based pc and how to use it how to exchange the messages across the mqtt clients that's it for the day thanks for watching the video if you like the video then hit the like button please share this video with your friends and do not forget to subscribe to this channel thanks again and have a good time